Danny is here in this part of the studio now with Made in Canada for this week. And this time it's all about a Manitoba company that grows hemp. But let's be clear <laughs> right off the bat. We are not are we about be clear to about go. <laughs> we are not about to go to pot here on CBC News Morning, right? Let's be clear. All right. All right. This is in fact the story about a food business. All right. It is a food business that was founded by three men, Mike Fata, Martin Moravchik, and Alex Shuayaski, who saw future in hemp. Now, when you think about hemp, the chances are you do think of something other than food, but Manitoba Harvest sells edible oil powder and milk all made from the seeds of the humble and very misunderstood hemp plant. Hemp's actually been uh, food for over 5,000 years. The, the seed is very healthy and um, very similar to flax. So uh, where people weren't familiar with flax 40 or 50 years ago, people weren't familiar with hemp uh, up until about 10 years ago because it, it wasn't available in, in Canada. Hemp wasn't available in Canada because of the other product with which it's associated. In order to grow marijuana, you, have, you just grow the female version of the plant. When we grow industrial hemp, we grow male and female. Uh, when the male sheds its pollen early in the cycle, the females all stop producing THC and they start producing seed. But it doesn't make the high potency THC, high marijuana, or high THC marijuana crop that people think about. On those grounds, Martin argued that the Canadian government should change the Controlled Substances Act to allow Manitoba farmers to grow hemp. In 1998, he was successful. I had been in business for many years before that and I saw an opportunity uh, in a ground floor basis. I wasn't uh, you know, uh, at the ground floor for flax, but hemp still hadn't been done by anybody. And so it started to uh, become part of the Manitoba agricultural economy. Today, Manitoba Harvest sources its hemp from 21 farmers who are shareholders in the company. All the crops are certified organic or pesticide free. Pesticide free meaning they can still use non-organic fertilizer. After the seed is harvested, it's brought down to the plant where it's made into five staple products. Shelled hemp seeds, hemp seed oil, hemp butter, protein powder, and their latest and most successful invention, hemp milk. The hemp seed itself tastes very nutty, uh, similar to a sunflower seed. So the, the milk and the oil and all the products have a nutty flavor where uh, soy tastes uh, beany. A lot of people don't like it because it tastes beany, but uh, the, the, the people that like hemp like it because of its nutty flavor. Customers also appreciate what are said to be the amazing health benefits of hemp seed, which contains similar omega-3 and 6 fatty acids to those found in fish. We would have um, ladies, senior citizen ladies that were phoning and saying that they, they, they felt so good because their arthritis wasn't um, bothering them anymore because they've been taking two tablespoons of our hemp seed oil every day. Um, we have people that are that had eczema or psoriasis and, and, they're, and, and they're, they're being healed by eating a, a, a diet that's rich in essential fats. Mike is one of the converts having learned the hard way about how vital essential fats are to the human body. I was, I was obese up to 300 pounds and I, uh, when I was 18 I changed my lifestyle, changed my diet around and uh, lost over 120 pounds. Um, but through that process I went on a no-fat diet which was very popular in the, in the early 1990s and almost died from cutting all the fat out of my diet. A growing recognition of the importance of Omega Fats led to meteoric growth for the company. In its first year, it sold about $50,000 worth of hemp-based products. Today, it sells more than $5 million. Um, it, it really is a, a, a global market for us because we are producing a product and, and, and can easily ship anywhere in the world. They're obviously, our, our focus right now is Canada and the U.S. because it is such a large marketplace uh, and very easy to, to market to and to distribute to, but uh, our business will keep expanding elsewhere in the world. If you want to learn more about Manitoba Harvest and their products, you can visit their website at www.manitobaharvest.com. I've already learned a lot. I had a botany reminder on male and female <laughs> male and plants, female. and I got an explainer on hemp and how it works. Now, since we the have taste. been clear, <laughs> there is no drug content. We will in not this. be sampling anything uh, illicit. No, we can, I'd love to have a taste of this. Okay. I've actually not tried it, so let's 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 this try is the, this. This is the um, I'm going to taste it too. First time. This is the hemp milk. milk. Chocolate, we thought that might be, <laughs> might ease our experimentation. You've not had this either? Mm-mm. Mm. Vegetable-y. 
it is a little nutty, which mm -hmm. is what they uh, which they said. I have to say, I like the, I do like this better mm -hmm. than soy milk. I'm not sure if it's the chocolate talking. <laughs> That's good. When in doubt, go with chocolate. Um, hemp seeds. We have. I don't know. This, this might be, good be problematic with All the right, lipstick. No trouble. I'm thinking. <laughs> Okay. Are they okay? And then yeah. there's also there's hemp butter as well, which is good for those parents who have kids at peanut-free yeah, school, issue. right? Which is everybody it drives me crazy. Um, and yeah, I like protein that. The powder. Hemp seeds are very good. You can put that on yogurt. I bet that'd be nice. These poor guys would probably have to explain every day their their work, don't you well, think? It all took the jokes them about like ten years to get the the law changed so that they could even market the product. I'm so sure. yeah, it's it's a lot of work. They're no quite Halloween dedicated. treats though from this I'm company. I'm going to give this out to anyone who comes to my <laughs> house. Hemp seeds for all. Getting hemp seeds. All right. <laughs> Danny, thank you for this week's Made in Canada. We'd love to hear from you if you have any more ideas for Made in Canada on future installments. We're waiting for your note. Our address is CBC News Morning at cbc.ca. Thank you.